Hi Debbie, it's Kiki. These are some of the suggestions that I have for you. If you have any questions or if you'd like to see something else, please just let me know. This book I want to show you is the Usborne Encyclopedia of World History. It has internet links and it is such an incredible book for children. Let me show you why. This book goes from the um, prehistoric to the beginning of the 21st century. It has internet links that are safe for your children to visit to learn more about the topics discussed. It has beautiful illustrations. The information is considered is presented in bite-sized chunks so it's easy for them to understand. I love the diagrams that they offer. It's just so colorful, so engaging, so, so, so interesting. And it goes through so much history. Here's Greeks and their war. I mean, this is just a fascinating book. I like to sit down and read this book. It's really cool. And the internet links just make it even better. Again, this is the Usborne Encyclopedia of World History. You can buy this as a set, individually, or a part of a collection. This book I want to show you is one of our See Inside books, See Inside Your Body, and it has over 50 flaps to lift. It's an extremely popular Usborne book. Classic Usborne, bite-sized chunks of information, and it talks all about your body. And there are flaps to lift throughout the book to explain to the child what's going on underneath your skin. So here is eating and excreting. You've got your food that goes into your mouth, what your tongue does to it, it pushes it down, goes into your stomach, here's your food in your stomach, it gets pushed out, here your liver um, is taking the nutrients out of it, goes into your intestines, they can see the inside of the intestine, it explains how the nutrition is um, taken out of the food and absorbed by your body, and then it's got your poop, the leftover, and finally, the poop at the bottom, they all love that, I'm sure. Um, it goes into breathing air, and it does a really great job of explaining how we breathe in the oxygen and how it gets transported through our lungs and through our heart and into our body. How our body pumps blood, bones and muscles, brain power. There's all these different flaps to lift to talk about neurons in the brain um, and the senses. And finally, we've got drinking and peeing, and it talks about the kidneys, how the kidneys work, what's your ureter, um, and then the, your bladder and how that happens. It's a really fascinating book for children, very, very popular. Again, this is See Inside Your Body. This book I want to show you is the Usborne Illustrated Adventure Stories. It's a really special book. It's part of our Illustrated Stories series, so that means it has a really nice cushy cover. It's hardback. It has a ribbon marker and to help you keep your place, and it has gorgeous, gorgeous illustrations in it. This particular book has five stories. The Count of Monte Cristo, The Prisoner of Zenda, Don Quixote, um, the Three Musketeers, and the 39 Steps. And this makes a fantastic read aloud book. Absolutely fantastic. And then as your child um, gets older, um, they can read it to themselves. But it is a really engaging read aloud book that will make them start saying, go to the next chapter, Mom. Next chapter, please. Next chapter. Fantastic book. And look at the illustrations. They're different in each story, a different style. So here's The Count of Monte Cristo, and here are the illustrations in Don Quixote. There's The Prisoner of Zenda. You can see the illustrations are just different styles. I like that. I think it keeps the book fun and interesting and fresh. Wonderful book. I highly recommend this book. Again, this is the Usborne Illustrated Adventure Stories. This book I want to show you is um, a Year in My Life, and it is a book that encourages children to be creative and to write. And let me show you inside. So it goes through 365 different topics, and it tells children to think big, trust their ideas, and have fun. And here's the first page. Imagine that this morning you woke up on a different planet. Draw yourself in all the amazing things you would see. So they get to describe themselves there. And then they get to ma make a list of things they discover during the day. Um, and it just goes on. Each day they have a different assignment to do in this book. Different topic that they can write on or color on or draw on. 
something to help themselves be creative. It's a wonderful book, especially as you um, your children are in the expressive phase of learning. As they're, ch as they're learning to put their ideas down on paper, this is a wonderful tool to give them, and every day they can write just a little bit and build those skills. Again, this is a year in my life. Be creative every day. This book I want to show you is Do Nice, Be Kind, Spread Happy. And oh, this is such a fun book. It begins by inviting you to become an official member of the International Kindness Club. You've got some badges here, and you have a mission to spread kindness in your neighborhood. So you've got several different missions. This one is Good Morning. Give your parents, grandparents, or guardians a great start to the day by leaving them a note telling them why, you are, why they are special to you. And it just goes through with all of these different super cute missions that kids will absolutely love to do. I adore this book. You're, I think your children will too. This is Do Nice, Be Kind, Spread Happy. Thanks for watching. Again, if you want to see something else or if you have any questions, please just let me know and I'll see what I can do.